Kaduna, just like many other states in the northern part of the country, is currently facing the challenges of banditry and kidnapping. This security challenge has led to the death of many residents, with socio-economic activities affected due to the inability of farmers to go to their farms. Zongu and Kauru local government are areas. This gathering of lawmakers, district heads, local government chairmen with the state government is to discuss how best to tackle the problems. It's a joint arrangement with the federal government. The federal government will finance the logistics of uh, 20 of these uh, volunteers, while 30 is supposed to be uh, financed by the state government. After about three hours in a closed-door meeting, yeah. the lawmakers brief reporters on some of the immediate and long-term resolutions reached. Yeah. One of the first steps is the urgent need to recruit more youths as community policing constables. By working closely with the traditional institutions, uh, the community leaders, uh, as well as the political leaders, uh, that is what we've been doing. Uh, I have no doubt in my mind. Uh, we will be able to tackle the problem. They also resolved to engage traditional rulers in the community policing arrangement, given their closeness to the people at the grassroots. We have gathered here in, uh, uh, in the chambers and we have discussed a lot concerning the uh, security situation. Residents of Kaduna are not new to such meetings, but they pray this yields the expected results of ending the spate of killings in the state.